Hello Ritz Carlton fans, I'm Kevin Ripa and this is My Sands 3 Minutes Max. For the next few episodes, I want to talk about the difference between size and size on disc. This causes quite a bit of angst amongst people who uh, have never seen this or, or don't understand the difference or haven't given it much thought. So what I want to do is I want to look at the difference between this and explain it so it makes a little more sense. When we go to a file and we right click on the file and select properties, we get a properties window such as we see here. And when you look at the size, you see that in this case, size is 13.8 kilobytes, but the size on disk is 16 kilobytes. So in other words, size on disk is, in some cases, quite a bit more than the size of the file. Now, why is that? Well, let's, let's have a look at this and how this works. We know that on a hard drive, before we can use the drive, it has to be uh, formatted. And when we format it, we're creating clusters. And these clusters are what dictate how big uh, compartments are that files are going to live in. And the NTFS file system, by default, these containers or clusters are four kilobytes in size. That's 4,096 bytes. How big is that? That's 4,096 tight letter A's or letter B's or number ones or space bars, whatever the case may be. Well, this, when we talk about this, is the smallest addressable space on a hard drive. If we created a file on the disk and it was two kilobytes in size, it would take up half of a cluster. We can't write a new file to the rest, the remaining two kilobytes, known as slack space. So in other words, even though it's a two kilobyte file, it still takes up four kilobytes on the disk. It can't take up any less than four kilobytes on a disk. So when we see uh, a situation like this, where we see 16 kilobytes, well, we needed 13.8 kilobytes. So we've got four, eight, 12, three clusters is not enough. We have to go to a fourth cluster for a total of 16 kilobytes on disk in order to have enough space to house 13.8 kilobytes of data. So remember, size is the size of the file. Size on disk is how much space on the disk, including slack space, the file takes. Now, there are some weird vagaries that go along with this. Like, what happens when the size has a value, but size on disk is zero? Whoa! We're going to talk about that in another episode. But in the meantime, and in between time, that's it. Another episode of 3 Minutes Max.